If you've seen Women of the Movement, then you know there's a warning before it starts because it's hard to watch. The series takes viewers back to Mississippi in 1955 and tells the story of the brutal murder of Emmett Till and how his mother, Mamie Till Mobley, dedicated her life to finding justice. The whole city is praying for you and your boy. I want a public wake, open casket. People need to know what they did. It's working. It's going to be a triumph. It's been said that Mamie Till Mobley's bravery helped fuel the civil rights movement. A brilliant cast is retelling her story in the six-part miniseries, Women of the Movement. One of the actors that's bringing this important story to life joins us this morning. Please welcome actor and producer Daniel Abeles in the building. Well, he's not in the building, but he's somewhere north of the city. Yes. Am I specific enough? You're very specific, yes. Oh, yeah. Not in the building, but nearby. Okay, he's nearby. All right, so yeah. thank you so much for joining us this morning. This is a very emotional story, which is part of American history, and we know that you had to send in your audition tape to, to them. So did, you, did they specifically tell you what the story was about, or were they vague about it? Oh, no, no. I knew generally what the story was about. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I got a decent amount of material to send in, and... Uh, just the, the standard process. I, I didn't expect to, to get it and be involved, but I'm very happy. And proud what? To Have you met yeah. you? <laughs> I didn't expect to get it, please. We all, you, if it's you, we're getting it. All right, so sure. the story, although based on, re on real events, real life events, your character, Chet Pacton, is fictional. So what can you tell us about him and his role in bringing this to us? And let's just clarify that he's one of the good guys. He is one of the good guys. Mm -hmm. He's a complex guy. He's okay. a guy who is a Mississippian reporter, and he comes up from Jackson to Greenwood, where most of the action takes place in the story, and starts off as your standard reporter, but then becomes intimately involved with the Till family and the NAACP in, in getting important information to the prosecutor to hopefully bring justice and send uh, these evil guys to prison. Um, so he starts off in doing his job and then realizes how, how many injustices that he can, he can help right in some kind of way. All right, so in the next hour, we're going to be talking to one of your co-stars, veteran actor Mr. Glenn Turman, who plays Emmett's great uncle. Broadway's Adrian Warren and Tonya Pinkins are also part of this incredible cast. And then behind the scenes, we have Jay-Z and Will Smith producing. Seriously, talk about a... Well, why, why did I not know when you guys were shooting in Mississippi? I would have popped out of nowhere. Like, this is the well, dream team. I mean, we were shooting in a total COVID bubble. I, we were there for a few months. It, it, there was snow, there was ice, there was, I mean, we shot through all kinds of adversities. Um, but you're talking to Glenn Turman, who, as you will see, is just a legend. He's mm -hmm. a beautiful actor, beautiful soul, and he does such an amazing job on the show. But yeah, Jay-Z and Will Smith don't, don't hurt. When they sign on to a project, you know that it's gonna carry some weight behind it. So I'm glad they, they they got on and uh, we could we could get this series in front of people. All right, so I stalked you well enough to know that you you started acting after you hurt your shoulder after play, while playing baseball, baseball, you moved to the city for a girl, but now you <laughs> are now co doing such great stuff and even co-founded Lesser America. Quickly tell us about what it is about. Wow, that is so much specific information. Yeah, I mean, I came to college are with you NYU scared? for acting. What's that? I went to NYU for acting, and uh, yeah, so I started a theater company called Lesser America with some friends, and we, we ended up producing about 12 plays or so. Right now, we're on a little bit of hiatus because the theater industry is so in flux. But yeah, I work as a producer as well as an actor and try to bring amazing stories to the stage. Ah, oh, see, I told you, we always expect you to get whatever it is you want to get. Daniel, we have to, we have to hang out more. Come back anytime. I know you have more projects you're doing. You're shooting a movie upstate, or if you've, if you've not done, done with it already. I'm a good stalker. You're a great actor. We'll be checking you out in the limited series, Women of the Movement. The finale is tonight on ABC, and you can stream it on Hulu and Stitch.